In today's video, I'm going to share how to use new Nair butter packs. And in this video, I will share how to warm up these packs, how to set the right temperature according to your body, how to apply these packs. And I will share all the tips and tricks with you. If you would like to see this video in a detail, then without any further ado, let's get into the video. This is the new Nair butter bags. It is perfect for legs hair removal. It comes with the five ingredients including shea butter. It is effective even on a short hair. Dermatologist tested result last up to four weeks and this is 100% natural and unscented. This bag does not drip because this bag's consistency like a butter. Now we are going to unbox this bag then shortly I will share how to use this bag. When you open this box you can see some instructions written on the box. You can read these carefully. This bag comes with the instructions book. You can read carefully before you use this bag. Next it comes with a wooden spatula. Next it comes with a 14 strips you can use to remove your bags. Next it comes with a two post waxing wipes. Next it comes with a bag stub. This is a micro safe tub. You can read the instructions on a top before you use this bag. Now I'm going to share with you how you can use this bag. First we are going to warm up this bag. Before you warm this bag you can open the lid. Always remove the lid before heating the bag. Make sure your microwave temperature is 800 watt before you heat your bag. And make sure microwave plate is turnable. When you heating the bags in the microwave, place the tub off center, not in the middle on a revolving plate. Like this. After placing a tub on a revolving plate, close the door and set the right temperature. Not less than 30, not more than 30, only 30 seconds. And start. Make sure you wear gloves when taking the wax tub out of the microwave. And this is what the wax looks like. Now before you use this wax, read instructions carefully. After warm up this wax, do not mix this wax. Check the wax temperature. It has to be in a butter consistency like this. If your bag is creamy or runny, then don't use this bag. Let it set for 20 to 25 minutes and wait for soft water consistency. And if your wooden spatula stand like this, it means this is the right temper for your body. Always test small patches on your body before you start waxing. Now my bag is ready to use. I set the right temperature according to my body. Now you can use a wooden spatula. It comes with it. And now I'm going to use a waxing strips. It comes with it. This bags cannot be rinsed with the water, so you can't reuse these waxing strips. Now take the bags with a wooden spatula and apply direction of the hair growth and spread thin even layers. And work in the small patches first. And now you can use a waxing strip on a top, rub little bit, and now you can pull on the opposite direction and you can see the result. It take all the hair from the root and you can see the result. My first impression on this bag is amazing guys. And uh, before you use this bag on your body, you can use a pre waxing spray. Make sure there is no any lotion or oil on your body. So spread a thin layer. You can work in a small patches or long patches. This bag is working great. Use the waxing strip, rub little bit and pull on a opposite direction. And you can see the hair. Guys, you can see the hair roots. Oh my god. And you can see the result. If you feel that your wax is hard to spread and isn't in a water like consistency, then reheat the wax for 5 seconds at a time, no more than that. For great result, apply thin layer of the wax in the direction of the hair growth. You can work in a small strips or long strips. Thank you. 
you can use a small strips or big strips it works great use the strip hold the skin tight with one hand and take the end of the strip with the other hand move the strip quickly in a one go in the opposite direction of application the strip must be removed as a close as possible to the skin right after waxing redness might appear but it will go away within 10 to 15 minutes next i'm going to use a post waxing wipes to clean the wax residue wax cannot be rinsed with the water so you can use a post waxing wipes it comes with it or you can use a after waxing spray and if you don't have after waxing spray you can use a olive oil and here is the before and after result this wax will take all the hair from the roots so i really love it next what you can do with the leftover packs you tightly close the top lid adjust the heating time to the remaining quantity keep the jar in a cardboard box along the instructions these waxing strips can be reused but if you used with this wax then not because this wax cannot be rinsed with the water if you would like to reuse these waxing strips then don't use with this wax instead of using this waxing strips you can use a disposable strips like this if you would like to see detailed video how you can wash and reuse waxing strips then you can click on the top to watch that video or you can check my description box down below now it's time to review this wax and I'm going to share with you my first impression on this wax so surprised look at this wow damn the roots roots and now come here wow did you see my first impression on this wax result now let's talk about the product how much product you will get only 150 g in this container when i saw this wax box length and then i take out the wax tub out you can see this much product you will get in this tub so this is too less than expected other than that i love using this wax my skin is so sensitive but i didn't feel any irritation at all and this is a perfect for normal skin this wax works great on a long hair and short hair it will take the hair from the roots i love this wax and i will rate this wax 5 out 5 star and i will definitely recommend this product to others this is easy to use and you can use this bags without any mess because this bags not drip at all you if you like to buy you can get from shopper drug mart so this is a new product in the market if you would like to see how to use their roll on bags and how to use their ultimate bags and how to use their hard bags If you would like to see these videos then you can check my description box down below or you can click on the top to watch these videos. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and hope you like all the tips and tricks. Before you use this wax always read their instructions carefully then you can use this wax. And if you like this video then don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video and share this video with your friend and family. And I will see you in another coming video on to then take care guys love you and bye and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to check out other videos.